You notice the tablecloths out there with the African prints? And the nice carpeting and the plants hanging from the ceilings. It's all Victor's ideas. You see, Victor always wanted to make this place like, uh, like somebody's home. And he treated everybody with respect. The workers, the customers, even the clockers. Like, okay, you asked me about last Friday night. We got three cocolo chocha face maricone trying to set up shop out there right in front of my business. I reach for my trusty Roelto Clemente Louisville slogan here and I'm ready to bash in a head, I'm ready to bash in an arm, but Victor, Victor, he says, No, Jesus, no. Let me handle it, please. We set somebody up in the bathroom over there, you know, do a little something like that. Put somebody over there in a, a lookout over in the window. I'm sorry, but you brothers can't clock in here. <laughs> This is a family place, and I need you to respect that. Here, I'll take these jumbo sodas. Some Pepsi. An orange. Rupi. I would appreciate it very much if you would leave the premises when you finish with your jumbo sodas. Usually they would just be happy to get the free jumbo sodas, but on this particular night, Leroy pulls out a roll this big and he says, My boss says that he'll pay you $300 a week if you let us set up here. What did he say? You see, Victor puts please and thank you into every sentence. So it was either... No, please, thank you. Or... Please. No, thank you. What, are you trying to be fucking bugger boy of the month, man? <laughs> Wait, 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 wait. wait. Your, your girlfriend likes you smelling like burger, isn't it? No, my wife. Oh, your wife, your wife, your wife, your wife. Right, got it. Mm -hmm. Okay, look. We're trying to do something here. I can respect that. So you take your business outside, and I have my business here inside. Come on, man, you can't even smile, man. You don't like this job. You feel that money. It's power, yo. I need you to respect that. I'm gonna miss you, man. So listen, I have to go out and check the floor. I got a business to run. So, Jesus. I pronounce it Jesus. I just feel more comfortable calling you Jesus. So my mother called me Jesus, my father called me Jesus. You call me Jesus. Oh, my Jesus Christ. Was that why Victor uh, left early Friday? Said he wasn't feeling well. Oh, fuck. Gotta make a call. There's a phone out in front. Wasn't feeling well. But you feel well after working 65 hours a week in a place like this, huh? It can definitely make you sick. You ought to try sometime. You give me your badge, I'll give you my apron, you'll be set.